my inquisitors are having to be on just like the highest alert right now. I don't know which one of these rock bands is doing it, but one of them is it keeps converting my cities and it's like of about zero importance because it literally does not, I, I, like I don't care. I really do not care. But it's just like the principle of it. Do you know what I mean? Like it's just, <laughs> it's just really annoying. Oh, I just fixed all of that. I literally just fixed all of that. Oh, 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 it's all broken. This is why you don't put all of your, <laughs> all of your sites on a single river. Oh no. Oh, let's get the diplomatic quarter down. That thing is worth like a good, a good like five political power a turn. Not diplomatic favor. I can never remember. Why is it called diplomatic favor? It should be called political power. Like I'm just putting it out there. That's what it should be called. You know, credit to Menelik. He hasn't actually got that much tourism. I think. 345 current. Oh no, hang on. That's my tourism. What tourism has he got? If I go to overall. Uh, 62, 83, 60, 49, 41. It just shows you how effective rock bands are. Yeah, he's doing all right, is she? Hey, what? I've got an available proposal. Oh, why does it not put that through? Like, I swear you normally get a pop-up. You have to check that so often. Just like go in here and go active proposals because my God, it just refuses to pop it up. I guess I, w I would love to ask for stuff. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's the rock band. Flipping tame bugs. Ugh. I might get music censorship. I'm just fed up of these rock bands coming in. I mean, it really, again, it doesn't matter. It literally does not give a damn. But there we go. We're in a golden age. Um, unfortunately, Curtin's in a golden age as well. So he's unlikely to lose that city. But it doesn't stop us from going... Wish you were here? No. Bodyguard of Lions is like the only decent one. I mean, building wonders, I guess, is a good thing. Although I don't have any campuses in order to get more production. So, to arms, wish you were here. Let's go for wish you were here. Uh, actually, no, bodyguard of lies. Let's go bodyguard of lies. I, I feel like none of them are very useful for me. So it doesn't really matter which one I go for. But come on, this is this is annoying. Like Kyoto, stop it. I mean, already we've gone to like 11 citizens following, and now 13. So like, it's just already disappeared just the principle of it. Okay, we're going to just chuck a couple of votes in for the aid request. I'm hoping that'll go through. I mean, it should do. Oh, moderate flood. Oh, look, look, stop flooding. Stop flooding, okay? Had enough of that. There's the Potala Palace. Nice. That gives me a thing. Aid request failed? What? Everyone voted against it? Oh. Some allies I've got, eh? Right, fine. You know what? Fine. I literally don't give a shit then. Let's use my diplomatic policy card to ban music from my territories. You asked for this. Ugh. Get Republican legacy and I'm grumpy. Can you tell I'm grumpy? I'm 100% grumpy right now. There we go. Get out of my territory. Ugh. Literally just, just because I'm just angry with the international community, I'm just going to steal Kabul now as well. Ha! I'm suzerain with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven of the remaining city states. I mean, unfortunately, with the AI as it is, it probably means they're all going to get killed now, but still. Serves you right. Anyway, I've got broadcast centers. That's more culture. Oh. And I've got aluminium hidden somewhere underneath all of that mess. That's pretty cool. Building a water park in Kyoto. Because actually I can get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven cities, I think, just with one water park, which is pretty cool. Oh, I love that. Um, you know what, I'm actually going to build a canal because you can actually, I think I can build an amazing canal little network here which will suit me quite well. Just because I can. I've got to that point in the game where I'm building things just because it makes me feel better. Tesla. Districts regional buildings provide plus two production and do they reach three tiles further? Yes. Yes, 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 yes. I'll get Tesla in. Absolutely. Oh, it's such a good use of my faith, actually. And then another 8,000 faith. I'm getting 700 faith per turn at the moment. So Tesla, I can burn him in Kyoto and then in Gifu. And then all of the cities I own should get all of that huge production boost. Which is wonderful. I need to pick up a source of renewable electricity, actually. Which one's the first? Is it, um... The satellites, isn't it? Solar farms. I should probably head down that way. I could do with a couple of sources of renewable power. More great people. There's more portraits, actually. I must have a couple more theming opportunities. What have we got? Angelica has got a couple of portraits here. We've got some landscapes. of it. a landscape that is put in portrait, which always really annoys me, that one. Just make it into a landscape. Just, just, just humour me. 
So El Greco, Kuling, okay, that's fine. So is she only got portraits? She's only got portraits. So really, it doesn't really matter. If I put one here, and I'll go to Okiyama and Fukuna. Yes, okay, I'll do. Have you seen how much political power I'm getting or diplomatic favor I'm getting? I've got almost 1,200 now. Other people are still getting it. If we have a look at Australia, he's on 611. Definitely producing the most 621, so he's getting 10 per turn. That's okay. We can force that below. Uh, we can force that below zero per turn. Okay, social media, here we go. So containment, I'm doing all right at the moment. Oh, and I don't need that, but I, collective activism absolutely is a fantastic one for me to get so we've got more culture more culture more faith more amenities more amenities and even more culture so now this goes to 611 600 and freaking 11 love it we're going to go to digital democracy as well for the amenities for the culture it's all good and also gives me the um the policy card slots that i could use build an aerodrome or an airstrip on a foreign continent not going to happen build three airports not going to happen War and peace, lovely. Okay, we've still got places to put stuff like this. If I just go to writing, the Appananda, does that actually allow us to put anything in it? I think it might do. What are these slots? Oh yeah, Appananda is literally anything. I didn't know that, I thought that was, um, it was just writing. Oh no, I want to put you there and put you. Oh, actually that means I can put music in. Oh my God, what have I been doing? Oh, I'm an idiot, I should have noticed that. Musicians have just been sat here the whole game, just looking like prawns. Never mind. Um, Kyoto, where are you? In you go. Just pop you in that and that. Good. That gives you three to put stuff in. Good. All of this is helping. Now, every single suzerain is boosting my uh, culture like crazy. It's wonderful. Okay, Ferris wheel is coming along nicely. That means I can now stick an aquarium in. Oh, lovely. Okay, the amenities are starting to spread out nicely now. Let's go for... I think I will go for a National History Museum because that actually will let me put some more great works of music down. Got the electronics factories, which are doing very nicely. Kyoto, Tokyo, just fix your walls. It's been annoying me, that. There's electricity. That gives me a load more culture because, of course, all of my factory buildings get more culture with electricity. Lovely. Liang. Here we go. Uh, reinforced materials is where we're going for. We need that desperately. Rapid deployment, let's go for environmentalism. Uh, build two solar farms, yes. That's quite nice, we're not gonna be able to do that, but electricity's cool. Um, do we stick on the top of a tree? Is there any point in going towards telecommunications? Not really, although actually flood barriers are important and I can buy them with faith. I need to do that because I have a feeling the world is going to flood, yeah, 20 turns. People are actually polluting it quite badly now. So flood barriers are good. As long as I can keep hold of the letter, the flood barrier with faith technique works perfectly. I'm also keeping an eye on this guy as well, Roebling. He's pretty cool. Amenities and housing for this city. That means I could absolutely pump up Kyoto, just make it an amazing city. Also Tokyo as well. They're both pretty good cities, but I reckon I could, yeah, just make it a little better. Right, how much for an aquatic center? 1,630. I can't be asked to wait for that. So let's just say I need this. Do you want some coal? Actually, you know what? People just want coal, don't they? I keep forgetting this. Give me 200. Lovely. So now we can go in and we can put the aquatic center in. Ho oh, ho! Oh my god, that will make the immunity so much better. Now where are you going, Australia? Stop settling through my land. Look what happened last time. Oh, actually. Actually. Grace. Grace is here. Two randomly chosen technologies. The problem with that is that I've got a lot of quite cheap technology, but actually rifling is the only one for me that's worth three, and chemistry is worth three. Okay, so it's probably gonna take a few to sod it. I'm just gonna do it. Why not? It all helps, you know? It all helps. Now, where has Grace been plonked today? All of my admirals just get in random places. Here we are, right. Two randomly frozen technologies. Um, that is computers. Okay, that speeds that along, and advanced flights. Hey, we got lucky. We got very lucky. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, so Roebling will we'll wait for you. Um, but now I could, in theory, just go through and only 160 faith for a flood barrier. Well then, I think every single one of my cities needs a flood barrier, don't you? Actually, less need flood barriers than I actually thought. 
Um, I thought every single one of my cities would need one in some way, but actually, this is pretty cool. Oh man, we getting ahead. Oh yeah, Tokyo really needed one. Getting ahead of this. Oh yeah, that's it. Needed one is is really really good actually, because if we would have started flooding, um, then building these things later, it just takes so much time. You just have to get ahead of the curve on this. Oh yes. This is wonderful. In fact, actually, does my face, is it going to stretch across my entire empire? I think this is going to do it perfectly. And yeah, done. Every single city has now got a flood barrier. Valletta, eh? Who says Valletta's terrible? So I don't normally like to bother you with really trivial deals, but 200 gold for four amenities. Oh, oh yes. Look at all these ecstatic cities now. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, it's so it, it, it is just what you need to keep all of your cities ecstatic if you can help it. Otherwise, you're just leaving all of that production and culture and science that comes with it just on the table. It, it just makes such a difference. Just 10% across all stats. I can't help but think, though, how ridiculous this game would have been with old gods. Just that 20% extra. Oh, I mean, honestly, Menelik is strong. I've, I've been looking at Menelik, actually, really. Like, I quite I think I might want to play with Menelik. Really, really strong. Now, is this still... Why is Kyoto not happy? I mean, come on, you should be the happiest bunch of them all. I guess the population is pretty crazy here. Eight for entertainment. Eight for entertainment and you're still only happy. Honestly. National History Museum is done. Okay. This is pretty good. What I'm going to do, actually, is I'm just going to switch over Pingala and Magnus. It's going to take a couple of turns to make that switch but it's worth it let's assign you to Kyoto because the population coming into Kyoto at the moment is pretty amazing and now that we've got the National History Museum oh it's good we just need to make sure it's all filled up nicely so uh you know what yeah just some of these great works we're just going to move a couple through look at that 16 extra diplomatic favor 16 <laughs> pagodas man Oh dear, 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 dear. I keep wanting to buy Renaissance walls just because, but I'm just holding out because, yeah, Roebling. 5,000 faith to get the immunity and the housing into Kyoto. I think this capital can just be brilliant. Look, Gifu as well is building an entertainment complex on this tile, which should hit one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cities. Oh, Japanese smishing cities together. Oh, it's, it's, it's just amazing. Okay, I'm going to hold on to these envoys for now. Just because if I if I hold on and then put containment back in, we should be should be happy because uh, we can double up on on everything. We're changing government soon, so that that make a difference. Somehow, I'm actually getting a culture victory at the moment. 72 turns. I haven't got a single uh, rock band, so I'm not entirely sure what that's all about. But cool, I'll take that. Uh, Menelik, don't you think like you're getting out of here? Come on, come on, military alliance done. Ah. Oh. We have discovered the entire map by now as well. I mean, if we check in, you can actually see the Kemens have this really sort of strange empire that's basically just mostly tundra. They've done really, really well. I'm quite impressed by how they've sort of spread out and they've got little canal cities as well. Oh, oh it's cute. Germany very much wedged in, but they've already they've got up 200 science from one, two, three, four, five cities and a couple of frozen tundra cities. I'm impressed with that. Rome has done okay. I always like seeing Rome spread around the map. They've done pretty good, actually. They stole a lot of my colonialization land. Australia got very smudged in. They haven't really spread that much at all, but they're doing amazingly well. With They had over 400 science at one point. They've kind of shrunk down. And look, you can see Menelik has gone for all of these little cities up there. They've got all this kind of stuff. And the trick to Menelik and why the computer just seems to be able to do them really well is if you have a look here, They've got 650 faith per turn. So for them, they get 15% faith uh, conversion. So that's like 100 science and, and, and culture just by having a strong faith game. So for them, oh, so good. So good. Yeah, definitely made a difference for that. Kyoto is now pumping out over 100 culture just because Pingala's in there now. His bonus applies to all of the great works in. Like you can see the canals being built here. There's another canal here. So I've got a lovely little canal going through. It's cute. It's um, utterly pointless, but it's cute. There is globalization. Nice. Okay, uh, music censorship I do kind of want to keep, but I'll get rid of Republican Legacy briefly because we're doing better on amenities now. And let's go for International Space Agency just to push us through a little bit of science. Makes a difference. 
does make a difference. Let's get refining. Okay, so globalization, that means we can now drop into the, well, the good governments, I'll say. Own a rock band for digital democracy. I mean, okay, that's pretty, pretty simple to do. Let's just quickly get in Roebling. Very nice. And let's get in a rock band. Uh, we haven't, have we actually, we have got, okay, right, we can. Let's just, I can't build it in that city. Rock band. There we go. That boost takes two turns off that. Okay, Kyoto, only got plus one immunity. No, 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 no. Here we go. Let's start burning this guy in there. Now, we've done the canal. That's a wonderful thing to have. What else do I want? I could build an encampment in like one turn. That would be quite funny. Uh, in fact, actually, I could then just use my faith to get all the buildings because, of course, the letter. If it makes sense to. I'm just kind of trying to think if there's any adjacency that we could be piling on here. But my adjacency is pretty damn good, to be fair. I guess I could get a harbour, actually. That would be pretty useful. And I could put some ships out to sea. Is that the best place to put it? I can't even put it on the coral, unfortunately, so might be. I'm just trying to think maybe actually that, that tile works really well. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put it here. Oh, religious rock. <laughs> oh, I feel some revenge coming along here. Okay, uh, athleticism, world games. Yeah, that seems pretty, pretty damn cool. Now, there's a lot of people are going to vote against me on diplomatic victory. Um, you can see one person actually, John Curtin, is going to vote up to gain diplomatic points. I don't know if that's necessarily true, but if that is true, that would be brilliant for me because I could just go all in on a diplomatic victory and see what we can do. But if I think I'm going to lose, then effectively what I do is I pick someone else that's going to lose and then vote for them. So if Australia is the one that may lose, what I'm going to do, I'm going to test this strategy out. We're going to pick Australia. So we're going to jump in on the fact that people are going to vote on this outcome more likely, but I'm going to force it to go to John Curtin. So I'm going to win it and get the one point without taking the two point loss. So we'll put a bunch of stuff in that. That's the, the dangerous one for me. I can put like 17 votes into that, uh, 15 votes into that one. That's good. We'll go for some votes in this. Now, uh, Menelik and Trajan are going to vote upwards on this one. I would quite like there to be a discount on faith at producing things like that. So we'll jump in on that. That would be really useful for me. And then we're going to say, yes, we would love it if people could clear the rainforest. Sure. That's great. Um, and then we'll put in as many points of this as I can. I think I've actually got quite a few votes. Nine votes on each, 15 votes on this one. Let's see. Okay, one of them didn't go through. Let's see what happens. Did people vote on me? People could have voted on me. Yeah, loses two points. Okay, how close was I? Uh, what did Curtin vote for? So Curtin did vote for himself. Rome voted for himself as well. Uh, there was 10 votes, 13, 16. Oh, we put 15 in. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Well, there we go. That's really annoying. We lost that one. We gained that one. So we, we lost one point out of that conference, actually. We lost a single point out of that conference. We're now down to 14. Hey, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter because you're, you're going to see the late game strategy here that basically cannot be defeated. So let's switch to... Uh, digital democracy. The immunities in all cities is fantastic. Um, so we've got sports media. Let's just quickly go for democratic legacy and republican legacy because those legacies are the best ones. We've got collective activism, international space agency, Bissell banker, music censorship. Good. We don't need any more of those. We've got the adjacency for theatre squares. We've got grand opera. We have the faith one, scripture anything else that we need here otherwise i might go for simultaneum because we're not after anything else at this precise moment yeah we'll go simultaneum that's good for me okay so the culture is now at 973 we are racing through okay smashing science let's just see how this does oh they leveled up and i've converted my religion to them <laughs> amazing okay we're down into the future era now Let's find carbon recapture. Uh, six envoys we've got now. Okay, we should be able to steal uh, Mittla, especially if I just quickly take out Republican legacy and put in containment, like so. Okay, then we go one, two, three, four, five, and then it'll go bump, 11, 
it's ours. We've got almost a thousand uh, culture per turn. Almost. Let's just make this even better. Zoo. And then we'll go for the stadium. Oh yeah. The amenities around here now. Pretty good. How are we doing on this though? Only three points. Ugh, I don't have enough stadiums or aquatic centres, clearly. Train some athletes. Do it. It's one of those things that you look away, but only for a second, and suddenly your entire land is swarmed with these frickin' missionaries again. Stop it. Now, I know the Kemens are going to get a relic for doing that, but quite frankly, you know, I'll, I'll let them have it just for the audacity of bringing all of these people back into my lands, but this apostle, you should know better now. You should know better, especially because, look, there's little naval attacks as well. I mean, why? Why would you do that? Just stop it. Here we go. Here we go, global warming mitigation. The end of the game, it's near. And we've got an air natural disaster. Yes. Actually, hang on, we'll put some votes into this, just make sure it goes very soon, as people like to vote down on these things at the moment. Oh, another eruption. Oh, delightful. Oh, hang on. Oh, yes. Yes. We've got Liang in the city. Oh, but she hasn't got the upgrade she needs. Oh, God. I'm so terrible at this game. Right? Actually, it's only the Pagoda that went this time. That's not too bad. Actually, all these tiles are so good. Doesn't actually matter if they're all broken, really, does it? <laughs> Let's face it. Um, okay. That's all great. We've got this being built. Let's just get the shipyard in Kyoto. Just helps, doesn't it? Lovely. Steel is up and running as well. Let's go for artist. Yeah, we like a great artist. What has he got? Um, that, oh, it's, is that Vincent van Gogh? Yes, it is. So I saw Starry Night and I was like, oh, great. Landscapes. We need landscapes, don't we? Um, so we've got Remembrance and okay, right, that can just get lost into some random place for now. So we need one in Nagoya. That much I know. Landscape, landscape, and one in Shizuka. And we should have two themed. Oh, great. Over here. Fantastic. So that is uh, Nagoya. Yep. So brilliant. I think that should be a themed building now. No? Is it not? Landscape, landscape. Oh no, these are two by Q. Q U. Okay. Um, b -b 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 where was my other landscape? El Greco. There we go. Okay, so we're only going to get one themed, but it doesn't matter. So far, this one band. Oh, it's doing a great job at just decimating their religion. Look at this. Three cities have now been converted. Nice. I think the, the computer doesn't complain about it as well, because I'm not actually using religious units or missionaries at all. So they, they couldn't care less. It's really handy, this. One more smashing science. Come on, keep going. Oh, these guys are good. They, they, these guys are giving me loads of gold every time they play as well. And that's four cities now converted. Oh, Ethiopia, what's happened to your religion? I'm just playing at this one now. Oh, creative differences. That, that was a shame. But hey, we just converted most of their uh, city, so that's pretty cool. <laughs> I'll take that. Oh no, Amar was just taken. Boo. That's okay. We've now got global warming mitigation. Okay, and the, the world is warming as well. Everybody's putting stuff into the atmosphere. This is wonderful. Like, you can see people just don't have the same uh, power they used to. And we're going to make this much worse. Much, much worse for them. Okay, replaceable parts lets me build the food market, which is a really, really handy thing to do. But now we've got, so I'm just doing a couple of train athletes just to keep us sort of in pace with this. Um, you can see my gold is just being spent in Kyoto, just building some nice stuff for me, like broadcast centers and things, but we're just, we're not putting any CO2 into the atmosphere. And now I'm going to start doing recapture, although actually shall I do some trained, I'm just going to do a couple of train athletes first. And then I'll switch to carbon recapture. I do need to do that, but I'm just going to make sure I win that project. Um, okay, what else do we want to do? Cultural homogeny? I'll get me the Hal U card. I want to just have some fun with some rock bands. I don't particularly need to, but, you know, it's always good to have the option. Oh, Jane Drew. Oh, this will make Kyoto even better. Everyone is now switching to carbon recapture. We've got already over a thousand political power, so we're not a oh, diplomatic favour. Come on, use the words right, Ryan. But... It's good. The world is currently at 1.1 degree. Um, everybody else is polluting. I'm not, so this is good. I'm kind of like the, the sea-walled Atlantis-like empire that's just sort of sitting here going, yeah, and? Oh, this is so much fun. When you, when you drop to this point of the game, you're just like, mm -hmm, what could I do? Oh, diplomatic capital. Another four per turn? Yes, my 44 per turn just isn't enough right now. Nope. 
Actually, the funny thing is, if I was playing as America, I'd have nine extra points right now. Oh, Teddy, where are you? This is so profitable. Just literally being the coal monger for the entire world. Just like, yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. You want to burn everything? Yeah, absolutely. Do you see that? 21 gold. That's all I got for that. Just like, not even per turn. Just, just, just 21 gold. I don't care. I will fling coal at people. I want them to burn it. I would rather give it to them for three. That's what I'm not telling them right now. I would happily give all this coal away for three. But I'm not going to if I can get money from it. Oh, he wants more. Oh, he wants more of the good stuff. Yes. Yeah, sniff it up. You love it. There we go. Look at that. We've got plan tier points now. We should get that victory point. I'm not banking on it, but fingers crossed we should be able to. Carbon recapture now is starting in pretty much all of my cities. It's a wonderful thing to be able to do. Actually, some cities can't even do it, so they are sending athletes. And the aid request, we're just hanging on. I'm saving up my gold now. We're going to do the usual thing where we just dump a load of gold in at the last minute and just pinch it. Germany, please could you not? St like, stop killing all of my citizens. Oh no, not another one. Not another flood. Oh, everything's on fire. Why is everything on fire again? Oh, I'm so technologically advanced. I don't need a dam to control the river. Just like, just, oh my god, everything's just totally dead as well. It's gone right through to the core. God, that's going to take ages to fix. I'm not careful here. I'm going to accidentally win a tourism victory. <laughs> a culture victory is coming pretty quick right now. Although, look, nobody's really getting as much power as I am. I'm on 1,300 now. Oh, this is a good place. Good time to be alive, eh? Zero tiles damaged by the dust storm. It better not damage things. I'm watching you, dust storm. Ugh. Anyway, I think my first carbon recapture went through. Uh, so now we are on minus 50. The world temperature's gone up to 1.9, so people are polluting like mad right now. But that's fine. Look at this, CO2 levels minus 50. Hehehe, <laughs> we're dragging the average down. So you get a diplomatic penalty based on how much carbon you're putting into the atmosphere, can, like compared to the average, compared to whatever the average output is. And if mine is negative, the average is being brought lower and lower and lower and lower and lower and lower and lower. And lower. So eventually I can get to the stage where I'm like, hee hee hee, people are getting a huge penalty just by existing. They don't even have to put anything into the atmosphere. Brilliant. Oh, and please stop. Stop sending stuff to me. It's, you, you're, you're very much embarrassing yourselves by doing this. Come on. Thank you very much. Uh, in you come. Oh, the missionary dies as well. I, again, the Kemens just, they don't care if their missionaries die because they get the bonus bits and pieces. But still, oh, the extra movement you get these days just by having the roads in place. I love it. I love this late stage of the game. This is my favorite time to be playing Civ. Yes, the early game's good fun. I like it when you get plonked on a random map and you get told, hey, look, where are you going to settle? First turn tactics, all this sort of stuff. Like, I get that. I, I do enjoy it, but this is my time of the game. Late stage game. This is where I really, really come into my own, personally. I really enjoy it. Please stop embarrassing yourself. Are you not going to attack? Come on, attack. There we go. Ugh. Oh, don't know why that was such a faff. Um, bring you in to get a little bit more of this bonus. Actually, can you move as well? Yes, you can. So, bam. That should be the instant kill. It's not. Never mind. Um, I'll just swap around with you quickly. Can you, can you not swap? Why can't you? Oh, it's because you've moved there this turn. Oh, how annoying. Whoa, somehow I didn't go into a golden age. I think that's, that's rude. <laughs> that's rude. Okay, Australia's in a golden age. So we don't mind that one. Uh, get plus one era score for each aerodrome building constructed. Plus one era score each time a great person is earned or purchased. Ooh, that's quite good. Um, oh, we could have got automation warfare. Oh, never mind. Okay, each time a great person is earned, we, we're getting quite a few great people. Oh, I could have bought the engineer. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. I missed that. Jane Drew. Jane Drew. Hang on. Oi, Ethiopia's using all their faith to buy up everyone. No, 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 no. We don't like that. I don't like it. Look at all this. You don't need all this. You know, I'm not even convinced they want to win. <laughs> also, when you get to Future Civic, I mean, we've totally won by this point. Hee 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 hee. Everything's still flooding and I'm actually cooling everything now. <laughs> My recapture's going really well. 1,600. I've now got more power than everybody else combined. I'm just double checking nobody else is going to win the game. Curtain is actually on the moon, but apart from that, isn't really doing much. So I think nobody, nobody's near winning at the moment. 
Yep, 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 yep. I like that idea. I like the fact the World Games is doing really well. I like the fact the aid request is only at 1,400 gold. I mean, that's just ridiculous. I like the fact that, like, everybody here is just so weak. Like, all of their religious units, they're just flinging them at me. It's all great because there's nothing they can do. I like the fact that Monet is here. What's he got? Landscapes. Oh, landscapes. Landscapes are cool. Uh, so I've got one themed landscape uh, building, but this one is not themed. Wonderful. So I just put this landscape down there. Is this one? That's Van Gogh. That's Q Ying. Oh, okay. This is going to be this is going to be a themed building as well. So would you put this in this one for now? So I need to go to Shizuka and Okazaki. So there's the first. Okay, this time it's going through. I want money. Give me money. Well, hey, some people voted it down actually. Boo. But anyway, it's all good. Oh, and people are at war with Germany. Oh, that's lovely. Okay, that's really, really good. So their, their um, diplomatic favor is going to go way down on this one. Oh, look, look. The cannons are just... Oh, they are concertedly attacking now. This is just getting silly. I mean, it's quite clear they're not going to get anywhere. Because my Inquisitors... I mean, they can heal almost immediately after this fighting happens. Um, so that's another one dead. I guess they are getting relics, so maybe I'm just sort of feeding the beast, but... I mean, oh well. Oh, here come the gifts. <laughs> oh, this is wonderful. And the thing is, I'm going to get a ton of money as well, because people have already been putting money into the Kemen one. So people are doing the projects. So here the money comes. Uh, you can see now I'm, I was on minus 350, but I've got another at least one or two projects, uh, Carbon Recaptures finishing now. So, uh, and the Future Civic happening as well. Oh, look, look how low people's stuff is. Oh, this is great. Minus 450. This is great. The average is going down. I've actually taken more out of the atmosphere than everybody's put in, apart from a couple of bits. I mean, that's, that's insane. You know when something's just too easy? It's like, are you doing this deliberately? What's, what's the play here? Because at the moment, I'm just munching through all of your stuff. I'm keeping your religion out. I mean, I guess I'm giving them relics, but that's not a reason to be sending this many missionaries over. I mean, I guess it would be for me. I, I think I have done the same on an old god playthrough before. So maybe it's not as crazy a thought as I think, but hmm, I just find it weird. I find it so strange. Finally got reinforced materials here though. Oh my god, that took a while, didn't it? So, um, you can see, actually I themed a lot of buildings. Like one, two, three, four, five, six art museums themed now. Hey, it's pretty cool, isn't it? I'm proud of myself for that one. My culture's still like crazy on people, but I mean, at the moment nobody's gonna win a science victory. I'm still going for that diplomatic victory. That's that's my that's my goal here. And I think I can do it because I am, I mean, look, nobody's been able to get out of three figures on diplomatic favor. People, if anything, are starting to go down now. And I 100% am not going down. I'm just spending all day, all night, killing endless waves of missionaries and apostles. At what point do the Kamens just run out of relics that they can pick up? It must be close. I've actually stabilized the world. I'm absorbing as much as everybody else is putting into the atmosphere. Really handy. Um, oh, 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 satellites. Yes, that's what I wanted. Renewable power. I need I need some renewable power. Look at this. Look at them all lining up for execution. Why? What are you possibly getting out of this? Stop it. Stop it. Especially because this missionary, or this apostle, just keeps coming back as well. It's like, you just can't get enough. There's the diplomatic victory point. Japanese athletes are just amazing. I'm on 16 now. We've got 2,300 diplomatic favor and everybody else is struggling to get out of the hundreds. So yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> I could do some theater square festivals. I don't really need them, to be fair. I'm just picking up stuff. I don't even need a peel. You know what, actually, I'm going to get Estee Lauder. She's really cool. I like her. Okay. Um, Bring everyone back. My Inquisitors actually are running out of health, not because they're losing, but because they've got into so many fights. They're just tired. They've got to the point where they're just like, they've shot so many people down with religious combat or whatever it is. It's <laughs> just debating, endless debating. Their mouths are parched. They are totally out of it. 
Uh, we got this one dead as well. Oh, yes, we do. Oh, look, it's just too easy. It's just too easy. Looking at this aid request as well, I'm just going to chip in and it is the Kemens, isn't it? I'm just going to chip in and give them a cool, oh, let's call it 4250. Just give the gift. Lovely. Aid request. Let that turn over. And that should process for me. Actually, I've got a vote coming up, haven't I? Oh, this is going to be hilarious. Welcome to the World Congress. Okay, so you can see that we've got this. This is what people have got. We've got three people with more than 100 and everyone has spent every vote they've got. Okay, everyone's spent every vote they've got. So let's have a look and see how many people, uh, how many votes they could put against me. So we know actually we know that at least John Curtin is voting for themselves again, which is hilarious. But everybody could put one vote in. Um, so Rome can put in three votes because they've got 40 power. Um, Menelik could put in four votes, so that's seven total. Uh, Germany and the Kemens can put five in each, which is 17 votes total. Turtle? <laughs> and then 26 votes total when Australia puts it in. Yeah? So can I put in 26 votes? Only 22, so in theory, I might lose this one. But Australia doesn't look like they're voting. So we're going to just put 20 votes in for now, and I'm going to see if I can make myself win other bits and pieces. Tourism from Great Works. I like the idea of music being put in. Climate Accords, yes. That's a great idea. And then we'll just vote for this sort of stuff. People normally vote for me on, on a lot of this stuff. Uh, we'll go for this. So we've got Trade Routes to me. Great Works for music. Actually, I think more people are likely to vote for me. So that's fine. If I touch, if I just go ugh, 18 and then I can put another bunch of votes in here. Yeah, look at that. Nine votes, 10 votes. I've got so much voting power here. Let's just see if this goes through. I think it has. I think it has. We've been awarded a lot of points. Uh, let's have a look and see what happens here. Sometimes it gets confused on the winning vote, but we'll see. There we go. No, it just, it just, it's just a straight victory. <laughs> There's no, nothing anyone could do about it. Like, I just, my voting power was just so insane. Brilliant. Oh, I love, oh, Japan are just such a good serve. They really, really are. Especially when you go crazy on the older culture. There's no, um, you can see my culture just goes insane. But there's no um, political or diplomatic favour. That would be a really useful thing. Or CO2 contributed. Again, that would be useful. Never mind. My science has just always been at the bottom. But if we just have a look at this, you can see that oh, nobody voted on this one. So my nine votes were, were fine. That was easy. Music, nobody voted on it as well. So I mean, these were just two, three points. I and mean, then who who actually voted for? Me? Yeah, John Curtin. He ruined the day for everyone. If he'd voted against me, then you know I wouldn't have won. Blame Australia. It's Australia's fault. I and mean, then the climate accords. Climate Accords are really funny, actually. So, look, you can see I have... Um, you gain score by having CO2s much lower than the biggest polluter and then decommissioning projects. Um, so, yeah, I mean, nobody was going to beat me on that one. I was going to win two points on that easily. I had need request coming that's going to give me two points. So that's another four points that were insanely... Oh, I've just... No one could stop me. What a game. What a game, eh? Pagodas, 16 diplomatic favour. Now, in theory, I could have gone to war with Australia, taken these three cities. I could have gone for war with Ethiopia, and I could have taken one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cities, and never taken the capital, and, and just been brilliant. Maybe I should do that, an aggressive diplomacy game at some point. Do you think that would be good? That might be good fun. Oh, I've got some ideas of some really fun games coming up. So anyway, next time, see you later. Come join me on Discord. Discord's good. Plug, 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 plug. You know I love to plug Discord. I think next time, I'm actually, I'm going to play a game where I can actually build railways. I think it's time. I've played a lot of CO2 friendly games. See you in a bit. Bye. And finally, a very special shout out goes to Scott Stratton for all of the help you give on Patreon, as well as everybody else who likes and subscribes to the video. Cheers. You help keep me going.